Hi guys, Felix Lee here. Today I want to cover an important aspect of gold. Okay, a few things that you need to pay attention on, you need to look out for before you decided which gold to buy or whether you want to buy gold or not. Okay? But before that, I want to take into I want to take you into a journey where if you don't think gold is important enough or if you don't think that you need gold or if you, do, if you don't think that gold is that powerful in terms of its value to hedge against inflation, then this probably this video wouldn't be relevant for you. I try to go back to why gold is important. When you look at history, let's pull the figures back in 1993, 10 years ago, 10, 11 years ago. When you look at gold prices, I'm comparing gold prices to currency, to its currency, to United States dollar, Australian dollar, or whatever currency that you have. Think about it. You've probably seen it in your own country. Two dollars back then, back in 1993. What can you buy with two dollars? You can buy food probably with two dollars. What can you buy with two dollars these days? That just shows that currency keep losing its value over time that is guaranteed because currency is just being controlled by corrupt government by corrupt banking system that has devalued your currency my currency over time and when you look at food prices going up petrol prices going up that is in fact it is a mirror of the devaluation of your currency that keeps happening so when you look at the history fact back in 1993 and compared to, to now Gold has increased by in, in, in its value compared to the currency by its countries are different. Like say to the United States, it rose in, in the figures of around 350%. If you look at Australia, it's, it's probably less moderate, it's around 250%. But if you look at further countries like Indonesia, where I came from, it went up by 850% which means that it is 85% increase by every year when you, when you compare that to the currency value. So you can see where I'm coming from right now. When, you, you know, when I'm trying to give this information to you, try to think and try to take my information and look at prices going up. It's actually not a reflection of the supply of product has gone down, but it is more that your currency has lost its value over time. And also another analogy, okay? When you look at gold, when you look at gold compared to, to other products, gold will be the one that grows in value the highest. Because gold is just gold. Gold is limited. That gold is God created natural resources that is limited. That is why it is it is more of value. Okay, but let's go back to our question. Okay, how do you or what do you need to look up for when you choose your gold, when you want to buy gold? Okay, how do you tell what gold is fake or which, which one is fake, which one is real? Okay, first of all, you need to understand there are two different kinds of class of gold. One is commodity gold. And the other is what we call currency grade gold. Commodity grade gold simply means it's your family or mom's jewelry, that types of gold that you can buy from your jewelry shops. Okay, but when it comes to different class of gold, which is currency grade gold, currency grade gold simply means that it has a few features that the commodity gold doesn't have. Okay, carrot bars. Carrot bar is one of the currency grade gold. What does it make or what difference does it make? Simply, the, the, the key here is simply in, in, in how you can tell this is a pure gold or not. Whether this is fake gold or, or you know, how do you tell? With commodity gold, what do you do with your mom's jewelry when you want to sell it? You actually have to go to jewelry shop and you have to get them to analyze and see whether this is a true gold or not. Is that right? But when it comes to currency grade gold, it simply have everything on it 
to prove that it is pure gold. Okay, let's look at one of my current my carrot bus gold. Okay, the feature here it has one of one of it one of the most important factors it is that is it has what we call the LBMA gold, which pretty much means that this gold is being produced by a refinery that has been approved by LBMA, which is London Bullion Market Association, which is a cop which is a association that determine or that announce the gold prices. Okay, so it is actually the, the you can say the highest association in gold. You know, the, 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 the king of gold association. So basically they determine the, the gold prices and when they give LBMA stamp, you can ask any jurors, gold jurors, they will know what LBMAs are. You know, London Bullion Market Association. When you have that stamp, it simply means that it guarantees you. It guarantees you it has, first of all, the purity, how much purity it has on this particular gold. Secondly, how much weight it has on this particular gold. So when it says, I hope you can see this, it says here 999.9, .9, which pretty much means that it is on the highest purity, 24 karat, you probably heard of it. When you got your mom's jewelry, you wouldn't know whether it's tw that is 24 karat or not because it simply doesn't have a stamp that says it's 24 karat. But when you look at currency grade gold, carat bus gold, it will have that particular 999.9 .9 purity. And the other things about it says is, is the, the weight, which is one gram. You probably can see here one gram of gold. So when when the issue of this card says that it has one gram, it has to be at least one gram, one gram of gold in it. Okay, it can be less than that, but it can be more than that, of course. One of one of our fillers actually has has its carrots bar gold brought to a jewel manufacturers and has the jewel manufacturer actually took the gold out and they measure the gold of that one gram cut to be one point one gram. So it simply means the weight is guaranteed, it could be more as well. And the other thing that you need to look at is it will have a stamp of who produce the gold. Okay? With Carabas, we have we are they are all using refineries which are all LBMA approved. So by you know, in having that, that pretty much means or guarantee you this is a warranty that you know my Carabas gold in my wallet would be equivalent to someone else's carrot bus gold in their wallet. It, it will have the same value. But, but when you have your mom's jewelry compared to someone else's jewelry, you can't say that, oh, this weight the same, my one is the same, so we have the same value. Obviously, you can't tell unless you go to a jewelry shop. And it is security value that carrot bus have is the security hologram on it. Okay. You probably can't see it that clearly. It is a hologram. Hologram simply is a security value to make sure that it cannot be fraud. It cannot be fraud to, to be replicated by some other people or by, by some other guy. You know, try to fake gold. You can't because hologram, if you look up Wikipedia, hologram is actually one of the highest security to protect brand or to protect you know, people to try to, to fraud or to try to replicate products. So it simply is additional security measurement to tell you that your gold, the gold that you're holding on your hand is real gold. When it comes to your mom's gold, you never tell. You can't tell until, unless you bring it to, your, to one of your jewelry shops and get them examined and, and see how much gold it has. Okay, the other aspects that I want to cover is someone probably asks why carrot bus or why currency grade gold is more expensive than commodity gold. Just like any other things, you know, any other products out there, different cars have different price. You know, even luxury car has different price compared to normal car. Let's look at, you know, I like one of my friends' analogy when it comes to cash rate. You probably heard of cash rate. Cash rate is a rate that each country decide. Okay, like say Australia have Reserve Bank of Australia, United States have Federal Reserve to decide what their interest rate is. And then that benchmark, okay, here it is. The benchmark is a benchmark that the bank will use, you know, another financial institution will use as a benchmark for their products. So they will put a price on their products. So say home loan will have 
business loan or commercial loan, we have around 9%. So that is a 3% differences of pricing. So same with gold. So lower class of gold, commodity gold, will be cheaper compared to currency grade gold because when you make a currency grade gold, you have to factor in all the labor costs and all the security measures that is being put into making of this precious pro precious product. Okay, so when you sell this off to someone else, someone else will take that premium into account and that and hence provide you or offer you a high price to pay for your gold. And when a lot of people look at prices, they look at internet spot price. Spot price pretty much means it's a price that is people that people use as a benchmark to trade gold. So it is more more like a trading, you know, buy and sell strategy. But when we teach you here, we are teaching you to accumulate gold in grams, in small quantity, and accumulate it over time, and to hold it as for long term. Think of it as as a a hedge and a protection for your wealth. Okay, and most importantly, when you compare currency, I mean. You know, it comes down to the last thing now. When you compare pricing, you know, what does carrot basket pricing compare to other gold? Okay, I guarantee you, carrot basket have one of its best price in the in this cl class of asset. I've done my research. You probably can find a similar some of the gold providers that probably provide a similar prices or slightly lower than that. But most importantly, this is important. Carrot bars provide you with opportunity to make money okay to make this as a business and you can see no other companies that you know gold providers can make this or give you opportunity to to use this as a business but carrot bus does because carrot bus want everyone to be able to afford buy gold in small quantities and accumulate it over time so and the other things is when people ask about network company, you know, supplement, um, vitamins. If I tell you today, I'm 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 generous today. This is one of my friends, Alex. Um, analogy again. I I just love listening to people's story, listening how people can use their imagination. Alex pretty much mentioned that, you know, think about when your friend or when you feel generous generous and you say okay guys i have a tons a truck lot of vitamins on my truck i'm rich now take whatever you want from the truck get whatever you want all for free you know your friends probably would take two three whatever boxes how many boxes they can yeah but when you tell them guys i have gold tons of gold in my car get how much you want, take it all you want. I bet your friend is gonna dig and search all of your car and find the, the you know the, the last gold that it can find. Because simply it has the highest value of all items, of all things on life, on earth. Okay. So it is that I truly hope that you can see, you know, there's no presentation or PowerPoint here involved, it's just simply I want to make it simple so people can understand from, you know, I'm not going to use jargon and all that. This is just a simple day-to-day -day English that, so you can understand. Also, also, actually, I forgot to mention, this is one of the gold that has been minted. Okay, there are cast gold or cast bars and there are also minted bars or minted gold. Minted gold simply means that it is more, it looks better. It, is, has, been, it has been Revined, and therefore it cost it costs more expensive. So when you look at gold that is being revined, you know, still but still has its purity, and also it carry but it has a seal, a, a really a secure seal to to actually protect your gold, so that your gold doesn't get tempered by heat by anything like that. So it is completely secure. So with that said, I truly hope first you get you get the point of why gold is the ultimate. Thing that you will need okay focus on the, the word need I'm not saying that you want this you will need this if you truly will care about your financial and your family condition I, I you know I urge you to do research I, I urge you to go to one of the best website here hidden secrets of money.com it is totally unrelated to my business but 
there is tons of great there's five, five episodes of Mike Maloney's video you know to tell you why our currency why our corrupt government has 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 gone to the deepest level and why your currency or my currency is gonna collapse in and why gold is the ultimate thing that you will want and you will need to hold on your hand so that is www.hiddensecretsofmoney.com okay so truly you hope I hope you understand the importance of gold and second thing I truly hope that you can tell and what when people ask you why what is currency grade gold what is the benefit of holding currency grade gold there you are you can answer those and how do you tell a fake gold or real gold the easiest option is to have a, a, a gold that is being certified it is a great it is the pure pure gold 999.9 .9 with the grams on it you simply know that but just by just having a look on the certificate here okay so thanks again guys for watching my video if you go if you if you have still have any questions in your mind contact one of us or contact myself obviously I will, I will help you to find out what you need to find out so thanks again guys see you guys in my next video bye bye